It's a beautiful sunny autumn day here in Krakow, Poland. I wanted to talk about something that I was discussing recently with a friend of mine who is also from Australia and also has lived in many different countries around the world. We touched upon this point that we realized frustrates both of us about Australia and at the same time I realized that I'm really enjoying living in Poland partly because of this and to summarize it in just a few words it would be the cultural attitude towards change. So in Australia there's currently a bit of a pessimistic mood about life, right? I mean it's 2024, there's a housing crisis in most of the English-speaking countries. It seems to be worse in Australia and Canada um, but that's not really what I'm talking about. There is, on a, on a broader scale, on a scale of even the last 10 years, maybe a slightly pessimistic mood about the future, especially among younger people, um, my generation, millennials, for example, and definitely Gen Z. They seem to lament the fact that our parents' generation, boomers, uh, who had lived their entire life in Australia, not immigrants, they seem to have a higher quality of life than we ever will. There's also this phrase thrown around sometimes on the internet that I'm sure you might have heard that the West, the Western countries are stagnating. That's a bit overly dramatic. Uh, I don't think so. But it does feel like there was a golden age, which in Australia probably was the late 90s and early 2000s. That's when life was best in, in Sydney, especially where I'm from. So what's my point with that? There's this feeling of the good old days that they have passed. There's this approach that we went the wrong way. Now we got to go back a little bit. Let's go back to the way things were. And actually you can see this in the USA as well with make America great again, right? It's this idea that, oh, we messed it up. We went the wrong way. Let's backtrack a little bit and, and bring it back to how things were back in those good old days. Very much the, the attitude is looking backwards, looking backwards towards the past as an example of, of how life could be better. In Poland, you can't have that. You just can't have that. Nobody wants to go back to the 90s in Poland. The 90s were a very dark time in Polish history. In other words, everybody wants to move forward. Everybody wants to get as far away from the 90s as possible. Nobody's thinking about the good old days in Poland. There were no good old days. Let's move forwards. There's this attitude of let's improve things. Let's improve our life. Let's improve our cities. Let's build. Let's create better infrastructure. Let's create new businesses. Life has probably never been better in Poland than it is right now. Things get better here every year and, and they're doing so at an amazing pace. All the time new infrastructure is being built, new businesses are popping up all over the place really quickly. In fact, it was a bit of a culture shock to me. Oh wow, look at all these birds. I don't know why they all took off like that. Anyway, as I was saying, when I first moved to Poland, it was a little bit of a culture shock for me to see how quickly new businesses would appear uh, on the same street that I'm used to walking along, suddenly there's a new store, a new, a new cafe, a, a butcher, a baker, a new gym opens up on the corner, new infrastructure is built, new buildings are built within the space of like six months to a year. Those changes happened very quickly. By contrast, in Australia, everything seems to move five times slower. Anyway, this video is supposed to be mainly about Poland. They want to progress and that's what I, one of the things that I love about living here because it affects me as well. The general mood of people, the general attitude. In Australia I definitely didn't get that sort of feeling. Instead it was sort of like if you share an idea with people about how things could be better, um, they would sometimes say it's okay the way it is now, why would you do that? Or the worst is 
partly the reason why I left is this phrase that you might hear, love it or leave it. Love it or leave it. If you don't like the way things are in Australia, then go somewhere else. And so I did. <laughs> Poland, on the other hand, and I believe the rest of the Central European and Eastern European and Baltic countries, I believe they have the right attitude to change. They want to move forward. They want to progress. They want to innovate. And as we've seen with China, China is now living in the future. And it's going to be the same in many of these countries and in Southeast Asia because they embrace change. They don't want to go back to the good old days. They want to go forward. Let me know what you guys think. If you could write where you're from and is it the same where you are? And if you're Polish, I hope you can maybe appreciate this little part about your culture because most of the comments I get from Poles about Poland are negative, like criticizing Poland, which I understand. Everybody criticizes their own country. I'm criticizing Australia. But there are definitely some things that I think are underappreciated in Poland, some aspects of Poland that are actually really great. And I'll try to share those in further videos on this channel while I'm still living here. See you next time.